Good evening, everybody. Um, it is evening here. It might be day where you are. I don't know. Whatever time you're watching this. Um, I'm new to YouTube. I'm always 51. And uh, I love Google Earth. I've been going on Google Earth for quite a long time. And I've realised that Google Mars is there now. So I thought, you know what? I'll have a little look. Oh, this is me, by the way. Yeah, this is me. <laughs> What have I done? Oh, shit. Okay. Anyway, so, um, where was I? Yeah, Google Mars. Um, I've been looking on Google Mars and it's really quite rocky. Plenty of craters, can't find any water or anything like that. Um, but I did find this. Where is it? This here. Oh, it disappeared. Never mind. Um, found this. This crater here, and it's kind of weird because it's got a ship on it, what looks to be a ship anyway. Um, I don't know if you want to look at this for yourself, but here's the where it is roughly. I'm no scientist, I have no idea. Um, I'll show you how big it is in meters. It's literally from there to there, so that's uh. That's pretty, that's pretty big, 469 metres, I think it's probably a little bit bigger than that actually, I can't see how, how big it goes, but nevertheless it's, um, it's definitely something, whether it's on the camera, that Google Earth, Google Moon, NASA uses, I don't know who films it, but it's, um, it's weird, it looks like a ship. A bit like the Titanic or something like that. So if that's a ship on Mars, the, at one point there must be in water. Um, but yeah, if you want to go check it out for yourself, leave some comments. I mean, what I'll be doing is definitely having a closer look into all these um, Google Earth anomalies and trying to debunk some of them, see what they are for myself. But I've just had a look at this and I just thought, that's really weird. It's, it definitely looks like a ship. But... Uh, yeah, have a look, uh, have a look yourself, see what you think, see what you think to it.